I think one of the things that is incredibly beneficial about the fellowships is that they supply the opportunity for you to spend time with a creative practitioner, an intense, extended period of time sharing ideas. And that's incredibly valuable. And that they focus very much on process over outcome or, or output. And for me, that's been one of the most important parts of, of the process, that I've been learning the processes of making and extending my understanding of what you can do with words, what you can do with language. I found that incredibly valuable. So one of the outcomes for me will be that in the future, as I write academic work, as I create academic work, I will also always create alongside that creative work, poetry. I think it makes me think better as a researcher. It makes me be, be much more precise in focusing on questions or ideas and really trying to convey those in a very precise way. So in my own practice, I think that creative writing is going to become a core part of my academic work. Incredibly good at encouraging people to be creative and to risk creativity. And that's something that I found incredibly valuable over the last few months. She really does encourage you and make it feel safe, I think, to experiment with poetry and poetic uh, writing. It became different from uh, relationships that I've had in other residencies where I've worked with people from other fields who were told that a poet would be responding to their practice. And so they're sort of giving you sort of information, but they're not really receiving anything or not really asking to receive anything. And then suddenly Tim was wanting to learn about poetry, was wanting to sort of uh, receive uh, methods and, and ways of practice, as well as I was receiving his research. And so um, it became a really fruitful and collaborative process. To 